That one almost hit you. You glance over your shoulder and see Melanie, charred and smoking. <laughs> the wind picks up speed. A tornado is forming. You anticipate the tornado's path correctly and avoid getting swept up. About the enemy. across a gaping hole in the ground. A sign beside it depicts a piece of armor, followed by, do not drop this in the hole. It's only human to want to do exactly what you're told not to.
However willing you might be, you don't have the armor depicted, so you walk away. Don't hold back. Let's do this. You hear a roar in the distance. According to the townsfolk, it is a very recent phenomenon. Rumor in the village has it that it might be the dragon. The man says the fishing industry is usually thriving in their seaside town, but recently nets have been coming up empty. He mentions that even the fishing harbor to the northwest has been suffering from poor hauls of late. A troubled woman tells you that there has been a rise in thefts lately. She speculates the recession to be the cause. She claims that even the cold medicine she always has on hand has disappeared. She narrows her eyes at the crowd, suspecting there is a thief among them, and offers a reward for the return of the medicine. Your ears perk up at the word reward, and you immediately agree to help expose the dirty thief. I can feel the dragon's presence. I must inform Lady Winifred. 
the knight mutters. You feel impatient, determined not to let the order beat you to it. You approach a woman, sneaking around in a corner of town. Hearing your voice, she turns in surprise. You see a vial of cold medicine clutched in her hands. You explain that the person she stole it from needs it back. The woman begins to explain her own situation with downcast eyes. My poor little boy is bedridden, she says tearfully. He needs medicine, but I don't have any money, so I took it. No matter the reason, theft is wrong. You ignore her excuses and take the medicine from her. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, my boy, she whispers, her voice breaking with tears as she totters away. You feel bad for her and her child, but know you must return the medicine to its rightful owner. Now to receive your reward. The woman thanks you for returning the medicine and bestows you with a reward. Unsure if you made the right choice, you return to your journey with a heavy heart. Thank you. 